Hello my dear friends, welcome to Recycle Bin Tech channel. Today we are going to see a Lenovo mini PC. In this we had seen an error. System uh, error 0176 system security. The system has tempered with like this is the error and we are going to see how we can solve this issue. We'll follow some methods. Let us see the methods which we are going to clear this error. First of all, if we press the F1, it will uh, directly will open the BIOS. While opening the BIOS, we have to see the, all the settings. Means where we have to change the, some uh, some changes. And uh, first of all, the things try to keep the system time and date exactly. You can just. Uh, whatever the time which belongs to you you can just uh, apply the main some changes uh, the things which uh, show the error uh, maybe the time the time related uh, maximum we have to keep it the time and date exactly it will uh, it will be good for uh, like a booting time it will show some error message many things the time and date is not correct like this whatever the changes we are making may try to restart and uh, that will be good and still the error is there and we'll go for uh, some another settings and this is the manufactured that date it's like a 3 3 and here the time and date is exactly correct what we have what I have changed before and now we will go for the next option and so you can see that ATA driver in this ATA driver configure SATA as is the uh, RST or uh, AHCI AHCI is the best for the installation means the legacy which it support uh, there will not be any error so we have ch made some changes over here and we will come back let us see the another options here all normal uh, option in this options we are not going to change anything it's like a default uh, maximum try to keep it like default this I am just changing whether uh, I had to see the error is still there or uh, it's clear I'm just making that software that uh, God extension is yes, enable and from here you can just uh, if you want keep that f1 f12 for boot option while we are giving s yes, because while uh, rebooting time you can see the f1 to uh, like for bio setups and f12 to like uh, selecting uh, uh, for uh, installation like boot from uh, boot manager or usb like this so everything some changes we had made here actually you see secure boot is enabled still there the secure boot enable it must be like a come different means we can enable and disable like that was option must be enabled in this we are all kept like a maximum try to keep that m.2 like a the what the operate where the operating system is we are going to install means in ssd means keep it the ssd first if m.2 means keep it m.2 first in this option you can see OS optim uh, optimized it must be enable and disable that option must come and uh, you can see the still the error is there and uh, let us go for BIOS one more time actually that uh, OS optimized uh, default like that that option must be we can, it must be enabled for accessing like uh, we can change like enable or disable like that uh, if that options are enabled mostly this BIOS option is cleared and still it's in disable mode you can see the CMS is disabled and boot mode UEF, UEFI only actually this must be like in blue color which we can change that uh, according to us if we want to enable or disable but it's still in disable mode we couldn't change from there so we have to go for another option let us see what uh, the option which we can do 
just I'm keeping same like this and see the still error is appearing or not whatever the changes as I said you before uh, try to restart uh, after changing the uh, the settings better to restart and still uh, the error is there and there you can see this F12 option is not enabled still there and now let's go for uh, a board let me switch off the PC after switching off we have to uh, remove this fan because under this uh, heat controller and fan only the CMOS battery is available we have to remove that one remove it slowly after removing that the two things we have to do one remove the battery and uh, short that positive and negative so uh, it will be reset the BIOS and just remove the processor for one time and just to fix, fix it as it same or you can uh, you can use some uh, metal piece to short that uh, positive and negative part or you can put the CMOS battery upside down it will get uh, reset just hold it for uh, 5 seconds or 10 seconds is enough no I don't want to hold it for more time and in this board one section is there for BIOS actually that I didn't show uh, in this video uh, it, it's in near to that left side left side means there it's written uh, like a BIOS um, uh, some number it's written actually we can reset from there also but uh, it's little risk I am not showing the uh, that place you can see the below this fan the place is uh, below the fan it's available after that while you are uh, uh, keep it like short you just uh, start and switch off the system again restart the system one more time okay but still uh, the error is there and uh, the issue is still there you cannot uh, it's not it's gone if this the issue is still continuing and we uh, after all these changes you made in the BIOS and you couldn't solve this issue uh, the last option we have to reprogram the BIOS IC uh, you can give in some uh, good uh, best service uh, shop that will be better they will remove this uh, BIOS IC and uh, they will reprogram and give after that it will be okay 100 percentage after they will be okay while all this method it's not working the last option is you can do this option and uh, it will be working 100 percentage will be mostly this option must be worked but uh, some uh, memory stuck is there in the BIOS IC so we can remove that and reprogram it 100 percentage it will be working I think so this video will be helpful if you like the video please subscribe and support thank you for watching bye bye see you